We begin our reconnaissance of the transverse ranges off of Point Arguello and Point Conception, flying eastward along the backbone of the Santa Inez Mountains and the Santa Barbara coast. Lompo passes beneath us to the left. We cross Gaviota Pass. The Santa Inez River Valley lies to the left and Lake Kachuma Reservoir approaching. We pass over Santa Barbara and Montecito. Then Carpinteria and Lake Casitas, beyond which lie the Ojai Valley, Ventura, the Santa Clara River Valley and the Oxnard Plain. The Topatopa Mountains and Santa Paula Ridge lie to the left. South Mountains straight ahead and the Santa Monica Mountains to the right with Point Doom and the Malibu Coast. We pass over Thousand Oaks, Wood Ranch Reservoir and the Simi Valley, the Santa Susana Mountains and Simi Hills. The San Fernando Valley passes beneath us. We approach the mighty San Gabriel Mountains. The northern limits of which are marked by the track of the San Andreas Rift Zone. As we approach Cajon Pass, the San Andreas slices diagonally from left to right, defining the abrupt southwest edge of the San Bernardino Mountains. The highest point in the San Bernardino Mountains is Mount San Gorgonio at over 11,000 feet. Big Bear Lake may be seen to the left. Following the route of Interstate 10, we pass over Yucca Valley and Desert Hot Springs, Palm Springs, the Little San Bernardino Mountains merge with the Cottonwood Mountains and the Eagle Mountains in the distance, the Orocopia and Chocolate Mountains to the right. We now accelerate to a speed of more than 20,000 miles per hour. Below us pass the San Bernardino Mountains, the rift zone of the San Andreas, the San Gabriel Mountains. The San Fernando Valley and Santa Monica Mountains. The Oxnard Plain. The Santa Barbara Coast and the Santa Inez Mountains. We round Point Conception and Point Arguello. Circling over Lompoc, Vandenberg Air Force Base, turning to the east, we pass over the Santa Maria River, looking at Santa Maria and then follow the path of the Sierra Madre and San Rafael Mountains towards the east-southeast. Now following the Tembler Range up into Blue Ridge and Mount Pinos, we can see the track of the San Andreas Rift Zone as it intersects with the Garlock Fault near Gorman. The Antelope Valley passes beneath us, Palmdale, 
the San Gabriel Mountains, Cajon Pass, and finally the San Bernardino Mountains. <laughs>